Tonight, Action On investigates a hidden danger in the attic that could put thousands of local homeowners at risk. This is scary stuff. Mm -hmm. Many experts believe a flexible gas pipe can trigger explosive fires like this if there's a lightning strike. Action 9 consumer investigator Todd Ulrich found it's been blamed in local fires and now major safety organizations say the risk is very real in a lightning hot zone like here in Florida. Smoke could be seen for miles when flames gutted this Vieira home after a lightning strike. In New Smyrna Beach, investigators blame the fire that leveled this house on lightning. But in separate lawsuits, homeowners claim it was this flexible gas pipe in the attic that fueled devastating fires. Do you think your home is safe? No. Retired contractor Charles Swafford discovered that gas line in his attic. Yellow corrugated stainless steel tubing, or CSST. The further I looked into it, the more concerned I became. Many fire officials and researchers claim the line can be damaged by lightning, creating pinhole leaks that turn into blow torches. And it has been linked to fires. The National Association of State Fire Marshals and the Lightning Protection Institute recently warned the thin walled gas lines combined with lightning pose serious fire hazards, especially in Florida. Once that happens, gas is leaking. Uh, it can ignite, and, and that's how the fire begins. Manufacturers deny CSST is defective and say it's safe if properly installed and grounded. But the parents of Brennan Teal blame that gas line for their son's death in Texas. As after the first week, we buried our son, and then we started asking why. Becky Teal says lightning struck a home her son was visiting. Minutes later, the ceiling collapsed. Their investigators claim pinhole CSST gas leaks fueled the explosion. The firemen were not able to save Brennan. But they did get there in time to save the evidence. The Teal started the Brennan Teal Foundation that found state investigators failed to check for flexible gas lines in lightning fires. We reviewed the Florida Fire Marshal's database. CSST is ignored. If the body of evidence comes up that there's a problem, then we should be looking into it. Now, CSST does meet current building and safety codes. However, some lawsuits claim the pipe failed in lightning fires even when it was bonded and grounded, like that teal fire in Ooh. Lubbock, Texas. Your heart goes out listening to that mother and the loss of her son. If a homeowner is concerned, Todd, about these flexible gas pipes, what can they do? The Fire Marshals Association says you should hire a licensed electrician and make sure it was installed correctly, that it was bonded and grounded, and it's not close to other pipes and vents, and that way you can reduce the risk, although at this point, not a eliminate the potential. Mm. Boy, that is frightening. It can be. All right. Yes. So interesting. All right, Todd, thank you.